Hey guys, Bruno here. Welcome back to Weed Farmer Simulator. Here we are for another episode. We're going to continue on um, with doing some things. We've got this big plot of land here, which I'm going to use to plant on either side. Um, and then obviously harvest. So we've got our three tractors now, which we're really lucky. Really lucky to have three tractors. Right, let's put our planter attachment on this guy. And then we can head on over. We'll go plant. Oh, there's a tree there. A little tree. Head on over with this guy. We can't. Can we turn the beacon on? Probably not. It's probably a little bit annoying we can't turn the beacon on because if you guys have seen me play farm sim, you guys know what I'm like with beacons. They're always bloody on. Always on. Alright, so let's um turn around back this thing into here. I don't know how to get rid of those plots. I don't think we can yet. It would be good if we could. Uh, what I want to do is leave a little bit of a gap between us and that um, stick. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go. Plan of management. We've got 205, 200, 205, 250. Try and get 200, but let's go 200. Okay, okay. Leave five behind. Let's jump into you. Start you up again. And let's start planning. Try and keep ourselves reasonably straight. Alright, there we go. So I don't want to go... We could probably go a little bit closer to those sticks. I don't want to go too close because I don't want to plant on the other side of the sticks, if you know what I mean. So... Alright, we'll start around about there. Jump back in here. That's a really quiet tractor, actually. Uh, put the rainbows in there. Jump in here. Get these ones planted. So if we run, ah, uh, there we go. Now if we run right along the sticks, it's, oh, okay. Some of them are sort of going over the other side. Got to be a little bit careful with that, I guess. Right, so that's that done. I don't know if I can actually chisel plow over that. It's one thing I'm sort of going to have to wait and see. So let's put our tractor back over here, just out of the way for now. Um, you can put the harvester on the front because we can harvest with you. This guy I was going to use to spray, which means we're going to have to get some water, I believe. Yep, it's empty again. Always empty. So we'll fill this up, we'll fill up our trailer, we'll go and spray these guys. And um, while they're sort of growing and doing their thing, we'll move on and try and make our next, our next plot. How many sticks do we have? 99. 99 sticks. Should have plenty. Alright, let's um, throw the water into here. Plastic barrel for dirty water. It says on the barrel. This is clean water, but pretty much means don't drink it because you don't know what's in it. Alright, there we go. Just about full. She's full. Let's jump on in. Actually, that's one thing I didn't think of, because now it's going to start spraying water too early. Ah, uh, oh well. Should be able to get up the other end, turn around and drive the whole way through. Hopefully. Otherwise, we're going to have to fill it up again. I didn't think of that, did I? You can't turn it on and off. Oh, let's spray. Let's get it all done. We're not going to make it. We're going to have to go and get some more water. Oh, damn it. That was a facepalm moment. Right, let's fill this thing back up with water. Probably only need to half fill it. That's a pretty silly move, I think. Really, really silly. Right, so some of these are starting to grow, which is good. Put some more water back in it, and then we can head back the other way. Boom, there we go. Jump on in. Let's go backwards and start spraying. All the way there, and then go all the way forward again. Alright, see how much that stuff grows. I'll jump out of here. Does it give it full... Well, actually, it doesn't give it full water. I'm going to have to give it a bit more. I thought it did last time when we were playing before, but yeah, I might have updated again. 
let me realise them. Not sure if it has. Um, yeah, not 100% sure. Alright, so we'll go and fill this guy up again and finish spraying the rest of those. Then I want to move over, as I said, and make our next area. So we're going to have to potentially, yeah, probably have to cut down some trees. Going to fill him right up. Let's throw our axe down there. Wish that thing would go away, the water level. Like Once we do it once, it shouldn't stay there, but... Oh well. Just deal with it a little bit. Alright. You see, the ones up there are fully grown, but... Let's go back. Spray them again. So that's 200. We're probably going to need about 300 seeds per side. To get a big area like this seeded completely. Right, these guys should be fully done, or just about. Yeah, I think that'll do. Let's go and grab our other tractor. Grab this little guy. Head on over here and we can start to make our next field and see how we go. Hopefully that plot's not going to get in the way. I can't get rid of the plot, so I don't know um, what we need to do to get rid of that, to be honest. So I think we'll just have to wait and see if the developer puts anything in which allows us to get rid of the other plots. Right, so let's... That's right, let's drag all the way through. I've sort of found if you don't go too quick, it's usually pretty good. It's a little bit of grass in the middle there, but I'm not going to worry about that too much. Alright, give ourselves a little bit of extra room so we can do a turnaround up the end here. I wasn't too worried about having gone too far. Obviously, we're only planting as much as we need anyway. I wonder, probably going to need to get rid of that tree just there. That little one. So that's probably going to be in the way. Alright, let's head back down this way. Still feel like we need to overlap just that little bit. Now, will this get rid of those stones in the ground? Or will they stay? Uh, looks like they're going to stay. I wonder if it plants around them or plants over them. Ah, you see? Sometimes it just goes back, even though you've already ploughed over that certain spot. Sometimes it just goes back and puts the grass back there again. Just something that the dev needs to work on. Hopefully he will. Probably already knows about it, but he just needs to work on it a little bit more. Even these little tiny bits. We're not getting the full width of the of the plough. Doesn't even seem to be working at the moment. I need to jump off and jump back on and see what happens then. But that doesn't seem to be working at all now. There you go, that's better. Maybe that's the solution. If it starts to stop working properly, jump off the track to jump back on and hopefully that fixes it. I'll head back down this way. to try and get um, this area done again. I don't think it's going to get rid of the stone. As long as it gets rid of... I see, then it uh, uh, pops things back in the ground. It's a little bit annoying. Especially when I'm trying to, you know, do this on camera with you guys and get it done reasonably quick so we can start seeding and harvesting and stuff and start making some more money. 
think we're going to need to do like another two more passes or something, maybe even three, just to get that full width like we have on the other side. So the textures don't draw very far either, which is another thing that hopefully the dev can look at. Things sort of just disappear and pop up randomly. Alright, there we go. So I think one more pass. And that's popped that back there again. Bloody hell, come on. It is annoying. And I think the more I do it, the more it's going to bloody annoy me. But it's only a small, minor thing. It just means we're going to have to go backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards more times than we probably should be. Right, I think that's going to be close to being wide enough. Gonna have to bring the water sprayer trailer thingy over here and have a look. Uh, go backwards, and we can have a look and see what we sort of missed. So the, the tractor volume is not very loud. You guys probably can't even hear it, to be honest. Right, let's get these other little bits. There we go. I want to try and, if we can, drive right next to this post so we can get rid of these other bits. The tractor does hit the post, so you've got to be obviously careful. Try not to hit them, but it's not clearing all of it, but it's clearing enough, I think. Right, let's take that attachment off now. We'll get this thing out of the way and we'll have a look and see how much more room we need because we're probably going to need a little bit more. Which means that stick's going to be in the way. Right, jump in this guy. It's just about empty. Uh, no, we should be right. That's probably just near perfect, that is. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. Not going to complain about that at all. Alright, let's... Oh, the bloody stick's pushing the tractor. So's that. Alright, move it over a bit more. Alright, that's probably not too bad. Where's our first stick? Around about here. So let's go from here along three, four, pretty close to each other. I don't know if I'm even like going straight sideways. Kind of just follow on where I plowed. It's totally not straight at all. I sort of went in in the middle there. Yeah, I certainly went in a little bit. <laughs> oh well. So you can't get rid of these yet, which hopefully, eventually, we can. Um, let's jump in this guy again. Let's plant this other side. Planter. Yes. Oop, wrong button. I can get no hitbox on the trailers and stuff yet. Alright, so try and keep the back trailer bit sort of running along the post there. See how that goes. Uh, 200 of you. Done. Let's jump in. And start to plant. Keep ourselves straight. It's sort of going through the other side. That's what I didn't want to do. Right, let's go back a bit. We can jump back out and throw these other 50 seeds in. I know they're different seeds, but doesn't matter. They're not going to go very far anyway. There we go. 
to drive. It's probably the wrong way to go because now I'm going to have to go all the way up here and around. But oh, and there's a little tree. All right, we need to turn in here. So we want to try and leave a bit more room now. I think. Keep pressing E to get out, but we don't press E to get out. That um, farms him. Right, those guys in there, okay. I want to go too far. We've still got five more seeds to throw in the gear, and there we go. I know they're not even close to being the same crops, but doesn't matter. Oop, wrong button again. Jump out, throw those guys in. But that does give me. That just gave me 200 seeds. Now that's weird. Even though I only had five. Okay, that's another bug I need to report because we can't have that happening. Alright, the way to stop that happening is to take that attachment off. And then it'll get rid of the rest of those seeds. That's a little bit weird. Right, let's park this guy over here. He can get ready to harvest away. Oh, so it's still us pushing the tractor around, which is weird. Alright, so we've got decent crops in the middle here. That probably needed to be over a little bit more, but... Right, jump in here. Move back. Get him ready to go. We need to obviously go and get some more water and fill that up. Luckily the water's not too far away. I think another another good thing, as I said, with us being able to upgrade skills, level up, unlock new stuff, unlock like irrigation sprayers, so not one attached to a trailer, but one you can put in the ground which like spits water out in a big circle. Um, you can turn on and off, so you can plant a big long line what we've got. Um, like this and you know put a sprayer here and then here and then here and here and then just walk along turn them all on let them all spray and then once they've got enough water turn them back off again and it actually costs you money but you know however much money for having an irrigation system one you've got to install it two and you've got to pay for the water you're using that sort of stuff um, I think that would be something that would be pretty cool This is certainly going to be our biggest harvest yet. Right, let's jump on this guy. Let's um, start to water away. Hopefully everything's getting enough water. Go all the way down to the end. Stop. Come back to the start. At least you can't drive over these sticks and damage the crop. That's probably a bonus because my driving skills aren't the best. Oh, there we go. We might need to fill it again. We've got heaps. A huge crop here. Massive crop. Oh, there we go. We're going to fill this again. Fill up water. I think it's all going to need a bit more water. Probably just drive through a little bit slower just to make sure everything's getting full water, but. I don't know. The game is actually pretty good at this state. As I said um, last episode, I'm recording this, I think, the day after the last episode I recorded. So, no updates since the last one, but, you know, it's um, still a lot of fun. Still a lot of potential, and um, hopefully you'll continue to update it and give us new things to try and see how we go. Oh, they seem to be growing pretty well. They're just about out of water, some of them. Be good to have a fertilizer sprayer as well, not just water. Right, there we go, jump back in here. Some of them got plenty of water, some of them didn't, so I think going just that little bit slower. You now like just like this, just creeping along, not going too quick. Should have enough water to get right to the end. 
Actually, the slower you go, the less water it takes off you, so... Well, I don't know how much they're actually putting into the plants. Have a bit of a look. Yeah, it's putting in a fair bit, so... I wish it would stop pushing the tractors around. So it's gone nice and slow, but now if I go back flat out, the water comes out a lot quicker. As you can see. Alright, let's put this guy to the... Well, wrong button. I'm pressing backwards instead of forwards. This guy over here, out of the way. I want to get rid of these. They're really bugging me. I'm going to have to put our next... The next run over here. Another thing I could you could do, um, instead of doing what I've done here and having sticks on one side, sticks on the other, and then running down the middle, you could put sticks here, crop in the middle, the sticks there, and then a gap. Sticks and a crop, and like, sticks and a gap. That way you can probably get a better straight line compared to what I have, because what I've done is not very straight at all. Not straight in the slightest. We'll get rid of these three, this one, this one, and this one. And that should be all we need for our next row, which I don't think we'll get time for this episode, but... We're going to be extremely rich after this this harvest. Where's that, those sticks going? I don't know. So you can just pretty much go and chop down all these trees and just make money off trees. Right, jump in this guy. Um, I want to sort of get a screenshot if we can as well of our crop. So let's come forward. There you go. That should be all right. Screenshot. Let's see how we go. I'd like to be able to change our camera view so we can actually um, go in to the tractor in the cab. But we're missing some on this side. But look at, gotten so much bud, double rainbow bud. We're gonna have over a thousand. Beautiful. I think, yep, just over a thousand. Alright, we'll go and get this one. We've got that one that we need to get that we missed. So I said, I'll let the developer know about that bug. Um, just have one seed, and just if you just type 200, it gives you 200 seed in your planter, which isn't cool. I mean, some of you might be like, oh, awesome, free money, but yeah, I don't like doing it. It's just like cheating. You know, you, what's the point of playing if you're just going to cheat the whole time? So I like to do things um, honestly. Alright, let's get these three, and then we can go down the other side. Right. 1004, the blue ones, 1019 are the other ones. Try not to hit our tractor. So 200C to give you a thousand bud. Or just a bit over a thousand buds. Alright, uh, we're missing, missing some. Keep the centre of the roof sunroof in the middle the middle line if you can right, let's go down this side at least try to because that's not even close to being straight look at that is that that's a random stick in the middle why is there a random stick right in the bloody middle who put that there what idiot put that there? It's probably me. Somehow. I don't know. That's going to be <laughs> annoying though. It's totally in the wrong spot. I do have sticks in my inventory, so it was probably me. And in my hand. I've probably done it somehow. Oh jeez, we're still pushing this tractor around. Oh no, it's gone now. There we go. Must be because of my having it in my hand. 
Then when you hit it now, you don't. It's when you get out that you hit it. So we've got 1,019, 1,979, 299 run, run, run buds, and 1,574 indica buds. Let's go double rainbow. Let's make, um, there's our tobacco. There it is. Let's roll a joint. Um, let's do the nightmare bud, because I don't think I've done, I haven't done all of them yet, so. Nightmare, we can do the deep chill. I think we did do the deep chill. Might as well reap some rewards from our, whoop, our hard working day. They're all, yeah, they're all different joints, good. Um, indica, what's that? That's Indica. So double rainbow. Which one haven't we done? Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Right, paper, paper. Tobacco, roll. Oh, sword inventory. I didn't say that before. Right, so double rainbow, nightmare, deep chill, indica, and run, run, run. What's our first one? Double rainbow. Smoke some double rainbow. Ooh, yeah. Don't do drugs, guys. Drugs are bad. Seriously, like this is cool. It's fun. But not in real life. Well, let's get high and early. How do we sell things when we're this high? Done that. That one. These guys. Those. Look at that. 59,000. 74,000. 775. Yeah. Let's. We uh Whoa. What joint is that? That is. A, holy crap. That's the nightmare joint. That is. That is a nightmare. Holy crap. What's the next one? Deep chill. Yeah, let's have some deep chill. Ooh, chill out, bro. There's no way we can plant like this. Oh. Wow, I can't even. Let's get. Let's get. Where are we? Okay. Oh, there we are. I can see it's down the bottom left of the screen. There's no way we can do anything like this. <laughs> that is crazy. As high as a kite. Oh, Jesus. Run, run, run. Indica. That's just the standard one, isn't it? Indica. Is this going to stop soon or what? Because we are off our chops. I want to buy our other tractor. There we go. Uh, vehicles. RS and J Retro. this bad boy over here. Beautiful. Alright, let's go the chill joint, which we've already smoked before I think. Let's go there just the normal THC joint. Yeah, that's better. See, it's not really as nightmarish. That was crazy. Don't, that's what I mean, don't do drugs. Drugs are bad. Oh, listen to that. Old steam engine. That is pretty cool. We've we'll probably never ever used this, but it is cool just to have it. Oh, yeah, we can put all the attachments on it. That's good. And the sound, the sound is all weird for me because of that joint. Really weird. All right, let's go. Put these guys away. Oh, wait for this these effects to wear off and then we can smoke the last one there we go Oof. I don't know how that affects you guys but jeez that is not nice oh so we just got high again for no reason hey look at his little hat oh Uh, so bloody trees, bloody trees. So obviously, I'd like to be able to have attachments on the ground, similar to like Farm Sim 19, um, sheds and I don't know storage places. Maybe even be able to build like a like this. We harvest instead of just selling directly, we can go and put it into a, a factory or something. 
and process it and make more money if you process it and all that sort of stuff. I mean, as I said to you guys before and the developer, the possibilities of this is pretty endless. You know, it's it's got a... At the moment, it's got a short lifespan, I suppose. Like, there's only so much you can do before you start getting bored. But long term, it'll be pretty good, I think. Alright, let's park this guy up. There we go. Let's have our last run, run, run joint. Holy, yeah, that's what we need. Music's going. We are running like crazy. God, I need to smoke these when we have the water. You know, put this in here and be like, fill this guy up with water. Then we need to go and fill it quickly. Quick, hurry up, we've got to fill it. We've got to fill it. We've got to fill it. That's a good idea. Make it run backwards and forwards really quick. Uh, right here guys, well um, I'll go and rest and try and get over all these joints we just smoked, but um, if you guys enjoyed this one, as always, smash that like button, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the game so far, and if you want to see some more, you guys let me know. If you've got any ideas for how we should do our crops from now on, let me know as well, leave it in the comment section. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet guys, please do so. It's been Brito, thanks for watching, see you again soon.